As fall creeps up on us, I'm faced with a conundrum. I'm a gardener and I compost my fallen leaves in the, in the fall to use. That's a like super good time to do that. Yep. Uh, there's Otherwise, so you have to pull them right down and then drop right them then. on the ground. Yeah, yeah, and, to, and paint them brown. Yeah. To use this compost in the spring, it's a cheap and easy way to build up my beds. A lot of my neighbors rake up their leaves and put them in trash bags on the curb. So here's the question, brothers: If they're throwing them out anyway, is it okay to just dr- grab them? And that's from Leaf Thief in OK. Hmm. Now I think it's oh, ooh. oh. See, if I knew. Without a shadow of a doubt, they were just leaves. Oh. But me, if I'm cleaning up leaves, and then I find, let's say, a dead pigeon, hmm. then I might just chuck the dead pigeon right in the back, right? Because That's compost, I, though, baby. Oh, yeah, but you're not expecting that I guess that so. Compost, you no, know, Travis has a point. It's just... If you get down to it, it's right. all compost, baby. You know? Yeah. That's yeah, absolutely. But like, what about gum? <laughs> that doesn't break down. That's so. True. That's not compost, and it might be in there. And also, like plastics is another thing. I'm saying any trash could be in a trash bag. It could be split between all your pop tabs and all your leaves. Yeah. Mm. No, listen. I think, J man, I agree with you in the concept of it might not always be the best option, but. I don't think that's the question. I think the question is, is it socially acceptable to do the action? I mean, of course not. If it was, then we wouldn't have gotten this question, and I think that we would all do ourselves. Disagree. No, but the, I'm talking about the reason I would be okay with someone not taking them. Because if someone took the leaves without asking, I would be like, oh, no, there's so many dead birds in there. They're going to be so scared. I now, wish wait. they asked. Why are there on, so man. many dead birds in there, Justin? What have okay. you been not doing? Like so many. Like a... Like a normal amount. Give me that of number right now. No thinking. Just say it. Five. Five? <laughs> Guys, it's the raccoon. It's the raccoons, isn't it? The, the raccoons, raccoons are murdering the birds and putting them in the leaves. The raccoons are out of their gourd. Ever since that one got stuck inside the garage for a little bit, they've been really on my case about things. So and it's I, a threat, is what you're saying. They're bringing they you leave. dead birds. I think as the a raccoons threat. are leaving the dead birds on the porch. This is my theory. How okay. many dead birds have showed up on your porch? Enough to where it's a thing. Okay. I'm saying. And the coyote. It could be the coyote. It as well. could also be the coyote. It but in that back. case, I would say the coyote is trying to befriend you, not threaten. Mm-hmm. It's a, I would take it very. I don't think it's the black bear. No one's seen the bear again. Can you wear a big ghillie suit mm. as you go around and you collect everyone's tree leavings? and Like a polka dot dress and the red wig and the, the whole thing, like a whole ghillie costume. How do you feel about the joke you just made? Uh, let me think about it. Gilly. <laughs> Damn it, you got me. I mean, dress yourself up in a outfit of leaves and dirt to make yourself look like a, a leshy or some other sort of uh, fearable Slavic <laughs> forest spirit. Yeah. And then- Or like you... I think uh, uh, Peter in uh, the Mockingbird game, what is that? The the Hunger Games. That's uh, He made himself and look like Peter. a rock. And, a, and his name's Peter. Peter, uh, that Peter would have be been. I mean, that's what they meant. It, that that's can't be his name. <laughs> they, no one has normal up. fucking names in that whole thing, man. Can't be Peter. Know that. They must have misspelled Peter. Anyway, <laughs> dress yourself up as a leshy or a fear bulg or some other forest spirit and come by and just start scooping up. You can't have a bag. Is the only problem with this plan? You have to scoop up as many just as your throw arms in the back can of your carry. Subaru. And then if someone sees you, they'll be like, "Oh, Martha, look, someone, some wild man is taking our leaves," and be like, "Don't worry, that's the leshy." He eats them for food. So he I needs d- those to live. I do think that there should also, be. Also, he'll kill us and steal our kids. Yeah, if we go out there and do anything, he's, he'll yeah. fuck us up. There should be a dedicated spot, like in yards. Everyone should like know that if a thing is set here, yes. that is very clearly, that's going away when someone collects it for the garbage. But if you want to dig it first, that's cool. Yes. Right? Because th- there's times where it's just like, I have no place for this. I don't know what to do with it. Putting it right? And I'm like, oh, that's great. I could fix that. Right? People could do that. But then there's times where it's just like off center in like the middle of the front of the yard. Is it yard furniture? Is this a yeah. frat house situation? Are, yeah. Are they yeah. leaving that out there for someone specifically to pick up? Or is that because like when I worked at the theater and like you see like furniture, it's just like, oh, I could reupholster that. Right? And yeah. In the show. So yeah. if they put this the big pile of leaves in the designated free to a good home spot, mm-hmm. yeah. take her away, baby. 
But if they it's put it not, in the middle of the yard, if that's in the center of the yard, that's for their kids to play in. That's not for you. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. Kids aren't still jumping in leaves, though, are they? You don't think? Yeah, we got to know better than that. There's mites in there. Well, and f- a, a five plus dead birds yeah. sometimes yeah. in some and, of the And a sixth one that's on its way out. It hasn't been doing so good. So Justin yeah. just preemptively and went it ahead was, and put it in the it's pile. It's so sad about the other five birds yeah. that it's just kind of waiting. Yeah, it just gave it's up just like one of those waiting. piles of plague victims back in the day. Just threw it on the car. Jump. You don't want to jump in there. You don't want to jump into the bird plague pile. Hey, let's take a break. Go to the money zone. Yeah, all right. 